What is up guys, Master Rolf here with another Clash of Clans episode for you. Today we are looking at loot and we're going to try and go out and get some loot. As you can see, uh, we're rocking about 172,000 coins to 52,000 elixir and we kind of need a little bit more of that. I've got one builder waiting. I want to upgrade a few of my walls if possible today um, and uh, to get them up to gold. So we might buy some coins uh, with the leftover gems I have uh, from my iTunes card I got for my birthday. But to start off with, we want to go out and see if we can actually get some normal loot. Uh, I also want to see if I can... I can, okay. I want to upgrade my goblins as well, uh, which will be kind of interesting. And that is pretty cool. So as you can see, I have completely redone my base. So I'm going to start off by going over what is new on my base. Now this is a uh, Town Hall level 5 base. Uh, and it is completely different to my level 4. Now, what I've done is I've actually gone for full loot protection. So, as you can see, I've got my uh, all my storages right here in the middle. Uh, all of them are level 8, uh, except for this one, which is level 9. Uh, and this is kind of what I'm trying to defend. Now, as you can see, that is focused around all of my defenses. I have even defenses on all sides. And I also have got nice level 4 walls with a few gold walls. And hopefully, I'll be able to upgrade... Uh, upgrade those gold walls uh, or at least the inner the inner circle uh, of gold walls today and get this really going well so um I definitely recommend doing this base now although you can get beaten kind of easy with it because at the moment as you can see I don't have enough walls to protect my town hall you can be one starred very easily but I think at this level, you don't need to worry about your trophies. You should more be worried about growing, leveling up uh, your 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 clan. Your sorry, not your clan. Your your town hall and your base, uh, and that is basically what I'm doing. So I definitely recommend this if you want to save your elixir and gold storage, and it is a pretty effective way to do it. As you can see, I've got kind of my army at the top here, which looks quite cool, uh, and we have got three builders at the moment in action. So I am upgrading up here my army camp. This elixir collector, and I'm also uh, making a spell factory. This might going to be my first ever spell factory, and I have no idea what it's going to be, so I'm kind of intrigued about that. So let's go out and see if we can get our first bit of loot. Now, I think we want to find something with at least 50,000 of both or more, and obviously something that's not too hard. That's kind of tempting, uh, but we can do better. No way. I got a like 120k the other day. I got one that was 120k. I was so freaking happy. And I was able to upgrade so much stuff. Uh, but sometimes you get them and they're really hard to do. Sometimes you get them and they're such a piece of piss to take their storage uh, and take all their stuff. So that's what I'm looking for today. I'm kind of looking for something easy. Wow, really? We haven't got anything over 50k yet. That's nearly over 50k. But we still want over 50k. Come on. Give me such an easy one, please, with loads and loads of loot. All right, here we go. Uh, now this one, yeah, I mean, this one isn't too bad. That, that's kind of that's kind of should be all right. Um, obviously, we'll have to see how it goes. I'm going to put that in there, uh, and then we'll do the same over here. All right, that should that should be all right. And I'm just going to send the troops in. I'm going to send someone in there, and I'm just going to kind of flutter them around and put them in. Put a couple of archers down as well, actually. Um, go on boys, go in, go in. Take the elixir, take the elixir. Take that, look at the gold. That's that's one of the main things I'm going for right here is that gold. That gold is looking sweet. Yeah, that gold is all mine. Bring it here. And they just, these goblins, I swear, are just amazing. They seem to rape a base. If they don't get, oh. <laughs> if they don't get killed by a mortar like that, they are so, so freaking good. Um... But obviously, as you, as you just saw, as I was talking about it, they get absolutely raped by mortars. Come on, get that last bit of gold. Just leave them with this thousand. Oh, nearly. So that was a pretty successful one, uh, I, I feel, for my level. Let's end the battle now. We got 54,000 and 62,000 elixir. That's pretty nice. Now, we don't still have enough elixir or anything to do any of the stuff we want. So uh, I'm going to... Make sure I spawn up. Oops. I'm going to spawn up all our people again. And we're actually going to go buy some coins now. Where people say, oh, don't buy coins or whatever. But it's like, well, I was given this for my birthday. Um, so I'm not exactly complaining. It's not like I've gone out personally and bought them uh, as it is for my birthday. So th that's absolutely fine with me. I wouldn't. I preferably don't go out and buy coins. Uh, sorry, buy diamonds. But because I got it for my birthday, I was like, you know what? Why the fudge not? So we're going to fill our storages. 
Oh, look at that. 751,000 coins, baby. All right, so let's upgrade the wall. So I'm going to focus on this inner kind of section. Get this all nicely upgraded right now. And then hopefully, it will first of all make our defense look so, so freaking cool. How much did that... Did that seriously just say that cost 75,000 per wall after? Oh my god. I'm going to have to buy like another another load of uh, another load of coins just to finish upgrading this because this is this is literally eating my money like I, I didn't even buy money that that is crazy. No. Come on. We're so close. Yeah, all right. There we go. Awesome. That looks so much better. So now we've got our gold walls uh, in there and I've also as you can see done all the corners uh, available with the gold wars, uh, gold walls, because that's where most people seem to attack, and I think uh, it makes it look quite cool as well, makes it stand out. So there we go. So that cost us uh, a freaking load of um, a load of coins, but we'll fill it, fill also our elixir storage. Um, you know what? We might as well do it by full, because if we do it by half, <laughs> look at them, look at those bad boys. If we fill it by half. We lose out so much more, and you know what? I might as well just pay for the better one. So I'm going to upgrade my goblins. It's going to take two days. Wow, that's going to take kind of a while. Uh, but oh well, that's going to take two days, and we now have 251,000 elixir, which is pretty damn nice. All right, so um, let's go and train up our troops. <laughs> Go and get some more. I want. Oops, didn't want that. I want to go and get some more um, coins right about now. That is that is my aim. Um, oops. So how many have I got? Uh, how full are, are all the camps? Oh, I only need one more. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Uh, let's put in one barbarian. Why the hell not? Twenty seconds for the barbarian. All right. So uh, let's collect these. So yeah, guys, if you are a low level as well, feel free to copy my base. Uh, it works super super well. Uh, and I think you'll be able to do pretty well at it as well. So as you can see at the front, I'll just go over the front here. Now this is while I am... Oh, I have one more wall. While I'm missing one piece of wall, which is so annoying. That, that I'm just missing one piece of wall. Can I nick a piece of wall from anywhere? No, it doesn't look like it. So I'm missing one piece of wall. So I've put instead a spring trap there. Uh, a bomb. Uh, another spring trap. And a, another bomb a little bit further away. So, and I've also got two air bombs, just in case any air artillery, I guess, come come in and try and attack us. Anyway, let's go find another match. We uh, we want to get some more coins. Oh, hello. Yes, my friend. This is exactly what I wanted. Um, I'm going to put that in there. Oh, okay. So, they haven't actually got anybody in here. So, I'm going to spawn up the troops. Spawn up. Oh, shit. Giant got just sprung into the air. Great. I didn't even notice that. I thought I, that was my mistake. I really should have checked it before. Um, but I didn't. So, you know. Sometimes. Oh, well. There we go. Alright. This has turned into a good one. Come on, mortar. No mortar. Oh, the mortar just missed us. Come on, we've got 18,000 more. Move. Yes. No. Oh, my God. Yes, goblins. You're alive, it's fine. There we go. So we took all his loot uh, available, except for the stuff out the town hall, but that's alright, that's only a few hundred. That's a nice couple hundred thousand loot we've just uh, taken right there. And we've actually done awesome damage as well. See what I mean? This base, it just is super, super easy. And we've been able to take so much loot from it. I'm surprised people have bases like that. Even me being a low level, I know that that base is absolutely bollocks. Uh, and we have got over 100,000 loot on everything. You know what? I think that is definitely worthy of a share. So let us, oops, uh, let us share that replay. Uh, 100k plus, where's the plus on this? Plus loot, baby. All right, let's share that out to the clan. So as you, uh, oh, we've got some archers. Very nice. Um, so as you saw probably here, uh, we are in war. I will run over the war that we're in at the moment once I get all my troops trained up. We'll go for one more attack at the end of this. So let's train everybody up. There we go. And we need a few giants. So you can see we're in war right now. Now I'm actually a war spectator really sadly. I have no idea why. But I'm a war... Uh, 
bleh, a war spectator. We're actually playing against the whole city of Dublin, apparently, which is kind of interesting. Uh, now, we've had a few roasted roaster changes uh, around here, but you can see now we, uh, we're we doing all right. Now, let's have a look at their top base just to see what our top players are going to be battling against now. See, I look at that, right, and I just, I'd be like, where do I friggin' start on this? That That is just crazy, crazy. Um, I don't know. I, I mean, that's just, I mean, some of you guys will be looking at this going, oh, really? Is that it? That's probably really easy. But no way would I be able to even touch it. Uh, so yeah, that's, that's their top base. So compare that to our top base. I don't know whose is better. Let's have a look at whose looks better. Wow, that looks kind of cool. I, I don't know which walls were better, but these walls look pretty cool. They both look like beast bases that I'm never going to be able to be able to take. Uh, looks like we've got a bit of acti activity here. Uh, oh, are people saying nice job to my to my uh, loot take. Um, so I'll say thank you, people. Recording a video ATM, just so they know I'm recording a, a video. Uh, so yeah, that's that's the clan war that's coming up soon. Uh, that obviously I will report back to you on. Which is gonna? Oh my god! Spell factory complete. Spell factory complete. Let's create our first spell. How long does that take? Oh, 29 minutes. Ah, oh, seriously. All right. Well, we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to do it. So I'm gonna have to show you. I'm gonna have to show you it in my in this video because I'm excited. I I don't even know what it is. So. All right, troops. If we are all ready to go and battle. Oh, no. Wait. All right, I'll let them go up. So. We need to get this uh, spell. What spell even is this? A lightning spell? Cast a spell at the enemy village to do damage to damage buildings and units inside the small area. Okay. Well, I'm going to finish that now. I know I probably shouldn't have rushed it, but let's have a look and see what, see what that comes up with anyway. How long until these troops train? Three minutes. We'll skip them up in the middle. Um, cool. So the clan at the moment, guys, is, I believe, 100% full. It is 50 out of 50. Uh, we've had a few roster changes. Uh, we will be looking for new people as well real super soon uh, to replace some people uh, I'm not going through it yet But as you can see guys as people were complaining I wasn't donating troops. I have started donating troops I've donated a whole 27 even though nobody wants my friggin troops because they suck um, Yeah, but I've got quite a lot of troops not as many troops as the rest of people here I mean look at that 2,000 he's done great. Oh and some hog riders the amazing hog riders, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the hog riders. Alright, let's go out and uh, and battle this. Let's go try out our, our brand new spell. Hopefully we can get another 100k raid. That would be pretty damn nice. Nope. Come on, give me something good, please. That's not what we want. That is not what we want either. What is going on? Why can't I find one that I want? No, that's... Oh, he's got a gem box. You should have probably taken that gem box. No, seriously? These are crap bases with crap amount of loot. Isn't crap such a satisfying word to say? Crap. <laughs> oh, find me a good base to attack with lots of free loot that I can exploit and take for myself, please. Come on, I know the next one is going to have... Oh, man. I don't know, is that... No, that's not good enough. We don't want 30,000. Come on, we can at least get up to like a 50. Or at least... Ah, oh, there we go. Alright, that's better. Um, so, clearly, we do not want to go in that middle bit there. That middle bit is an absolute danger zone. He is defending the log. That is the log of health right up there, if you if you didn't already know. Anyway, let's go in and, and attack this guy. So, we're going to go for a storage, which is uh, over on this side. Uh, I'm going to spawn up a couple of troops here. And I'm going to spawn up uh, two wall breakers. And with giants following that guy. And then I'm going to spawn up the same over here with two wall breakers right there to hopefully destroy that wall. Now, here come the spell. I'm going to use the spell here. Go spell! Oh, what? Awesome! That's nearly taken out that whole thing. All right, I'm going to use this, all this stuff I have here. So we've got archers. No hogs. It's all right, hogs. Hogs are going to do it. That spell is awesome. I did not know that is what it did. Ah. Uh, but that worked an absolute treat. We can now spawn in our goblins to go and finish up on the elixir on that side. It's going to be another accept, uh, successful loot right here, guys. Going to at least take... I think we might... Oh, no. Low battery. No. 
Come on, we can do this. My I my iPad always runs out of battery. Go team, take everything. Why did so many things die in the middle here? That looks pretty impressive graveyard. Yes, that is what we're talking about. There's the loot, and there was our first use of the spell, which was absolutely awesome. I've definitely got to get some more of them. Uh, but there we go, 75,000 and 55,000. Not bad at all. So can we upgrade anything else in here that is worthy? We can probably we'll, we can finish this wall right here. So uh, let's finish this kind of wall up to there. And there we go. That looks a little bit better. Now I just need to kind of finish this side as well, which I'll hopefully be able to do soon. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. I've tried to cover a load of stuff on this one, uh, so I hope you have enjoyed it. I will see you tomorrow for the next one. Until then, have a great day, everybody, and I will see you then. Peace out.